Hello and welcome. In today's video, we will explore another feature as part of 1031 version. This is on the cash and bank management advanced bank reconciliation area. This feature is all about the new voucher and the date for new transactions in the advanced bank reconciliation bank statement. After enabling this feature, the bank statement or bank charges which is imposed by the bank and the organization get to know by looking into the bank, the bank statement, those transactions will be posted automatically and it has been posted automatically as of now but the booking date will be used as a posting date of those transactions. As of now, system is to pick up those as new transactions. However, those transactions was, was getting posted by the system on the same date where the import in, on the uh, when the statement has been imported other than using the booking date of the bank statement. Let's see what is the change. I will go to bank accounts. I will import a bank statement. I have created a bank and a dummy bank statement for this. So I will use this bank. I will go to bank statement. I will import a bank statement. And then I have created a dummy bank statement so that it can match automatically with having the new transactions. So I have used interest as a new transactions. I will click on OK. Let's see. Let's wait for a couple of seconds. It will be imported and see it has been matched. So it has been matched by the matching rules. And if I go to the bank statement, you see there is the new transaction because the interest has been imposed, imposed by the bank and the booking date is on 7th of September and 8th of September respectively. And I am using, I am doing this demo on January 2023. 20, so ideally this booking date and this transaction has been picked up, picked up by the Dynamics as a interest charges, as a new transaction the transaction data booking date on the bank statement which is September. So by enabling this feature when this is automatically posted to the system the posting date will be used as a same as booking date. So I will click on post. It has been posted. I will directly click on this bank account. I will go to transactions. Now you see the Posting date has been used as the same date when the bank statement has sent to the organization and the bank statement booking date. The same date the interest was applied or as ad imposed by the bank to the organization. As of now, this functionality was not there. The functionality was like even if the booking date was in September, however, the posting date of those transactions used to be like when the statement has been imported into the system. I will show you the example I have created, I have, yes, uh, I have imported one bank statement without having this feature yesterday. So I will go to one bank account, which is this SCI and you see the transaction was posted on 17. If I look, take a look at the bank statement booking date, I will click on the statement ID. And you see this is the same booking date which is September but as the feature I have I have not enabled I had not enabled yesterday so the transaction was posted on the import statement date which is on January 2023 so take a look see so now by enabling this feature it will resolve a lot of issues because this has been a much awaited feature and personally I have faced you know, a lot of feedback or I've got a lot of feedback from different organizations and you see uh, this has been very common requirement and this has come from a idea from the idea portal. So that's it for, for, for this you know video. I hope you have understood and you will be able to sell this to the organization that this functionality is there. Yeah, let's wait for the another feature. I will come back. As of now, thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.